Looking good? You mean, considering the shit we've been through? Well, factor that in and you look fucking amazing. So what's the latest from Clouds? Know anything? Nothing of any interest. We've got a new situation and everybody's trying to adapt. Me too. Doesn't sound like it's all okay. Doesn't mean it isn't. Any news from the Moxers? Events? Ideas? Don't know. Don't see all that much of them. How come? You know how they are. Piss me off sometimes is all. Something got you down all of a sudden? Um, no. Judy? Can we please not talk about clouds, the Mox, or Arasaka, and Militech, and how the world's going to shit? Just rather not think about any of that today. Anything dark. So ready to tell me what we're doing here? Well, I've been tinkering with virtues a lot lately and figured out a way to scroll two actors' experiences at the same time. Thought we could try it out. If you're down, of course. How does one marry two separate neural tracks? Well, at first I tried to create a single profile out of two data streams. Didn't turn out so great. Must have gotten tangled up. Interference, white noise. Yeah, effect was kind of like a bad art house. Couple tries in, though. I managed to isolate specific sensations. So you load them onto separate neural tracks. No emo bogeys. Not bad. Sounds like we could do this anywhere. Why did we come all the way out here? What is this place? Cottage belonged to someone I knew. It sits empty now. I take the liberty to use it from time to time. And that's where we're gonna scroll? No, we're gonna scroll underwater. Nope, no way. Bad idea. Tell her to find some other yes woman. What do you say? You in? Why would you say that? I don't know. Don't like the idea, that's all. It's just, when I think about the dark, the deep, palms that I don't fucking have get clammy with sweat I don't secrete. You're more than welcome to stay on shore. Hell yeah, I'm in. Awesome. So, uh, let's go. Got the hardware here. All right, get that booty of yours suited up. Why'd you choose this, of all places? Why? Don't like it? It's okay, but any special reason why you chose this one? Of course there is, but you'll have to wait to find out what it is. Do this often? What? Make other girls put on skin-tight wetsuits? Mint diving. As often as I can. As for the rest, well, I'm picky about my girls. Let's get this scroller on you. Haven't even asked me if I know how to swim. Not worried I'll just sink to the bottom like a bag of rocks? A bag of rocks? Come on, don't sell yourself short. Water's toxic, that not a problem? Whole reason we're suiting up. Look pretty damn fine in that wetsuit. You should see me in my Max Tech uniform. Whoa, mean you have one? Indeed I do. Won it in a bet. Still hangs in my closet waiting for the right occasion. Huh. I'm gonna hold you to that. All right, let's do this. Whew, freezing ass water, here I come. Okay, we're all set. You go first. Stay close 
behind me. And don't descend too fast. Where are we headed, exactly? About halfway to the deepest point. It'll be pitch black, but the currents are gentle. Ought to be safe. Want the precise coordinates? No, I bother. I'll just stay close to you. Okie dokes. Virtues are more to you than just a way to churn out eddies, huh? Well, duh. Think it. Paintings, songs, they're meant to produce emotion responses. Generally how any kind of creativity works, sure. Right, so art's a casing, trigger for emotion. Well, BDs are emotion in near pure form. First up, motion sensors and scrolling. Circle around me, swim. Enjoying the view? Visual sensors are getting stemmed right now. Can't be denied. I think I never realized how fit you were. <laughs> Don't get excited. Oxygen supply is limited. Great motion calibrated. Now swim hither. Next up, sound check. I'm gonna hum a song, you give me the title. Read me. No idea what the song is, but I heard it. Uh, it goes something like... tuned and synced. And you got talent, girl. All right, that ought to do it. We are now... Synced. Why now? Prepare to have your mind blown. Wait for it. Grab this and hold on tight. Down we go. That's incredible. What is it? Our very own Atlantis. It used to be called Laguna Bend. Just 15 years ago, people still lived here. Got some connection to this place, right? You got it. Grew up here. Haven't been back since Laguna Bend was wiped off the map. Why are you showing me this? It's important to me. Got a feeling this will be perfect for my experiment. Why does this stand to be perfect? Hoping you'll be able to pick up all the unfiltered mess of emotions this place brings out in me. Like it or not, you'll react to those feelings. That's what I want to capture. Sounds Nova. Let's do this. I played this moment coming back so many times in my head. Taking me years. Working up the nerve for this. Why didn't you come earlier? Good question. Easy answer would be that I didn't have time. Gear, stars weren't ever aligned. The truth is, the very idea just felt weird. Sci 
didn't want to come here alone. Or with some rando. Best eatery in town. Only one at that, too. Burgers weren't amazing. Too greasy. Big. Of course, I say that now. Back then, they were the best thing I'd ever chewed and swallowed. And next door, that's where we lived. Me and my grandparents. Just let me know when you want to forge ahead. Looks like this fell off your one and only eatery. Now let's see. Childhood for you tasted like sushi with real rice. Used to stuff a few in your mouth at once and pretend you were a giant. I don't even know anymore. It's hard to separate actual memories from what you want to remember. Well, our brains weren't built with perfect memory. Weird place for a framed picture. Water probably carried it out of someone's house. Anything to make out? No, not much. Got something here. Looks like an old photo cam. DPI 350. Practically an antique. Like it? You kidding? It's awesome. Hockey stick? Is there a skating rink here? I wish. Played street hockey on rollerblades. Quit schmoozing, Alvarez. We're losing because of you. Connie! You're dead meat anyway. Go out with me. Sorry, gotta go. They're calling. They're calling. What about your parents? Dad was never in the picture. Mom died when I was tiny. Can barely remember her. Still have her picture, but, you know... I see a stranger there. Judy, Judy, watch out for her cooties. She can't even afford to have parents. <laughs> Who's that? Those voices. Voices? Didn't hear anything but you just now. What was it like living with your grandparents? How were they? Granddad had a real knack for things technical. Taught me everything I know. And the stories he told. Oh, never got bored listening to him. And Grandma was... temperamental. Hot one second, cool as steel the next. Temperamental, huh? Well, that explains a lot. Dominant family trait? <laughs> no idea what you're talking about. Where'd your grandparents go? Night City? Yeah, for a couple years. Rented the unit that's mine now. But they hated the city. Moved up to Oregon. And still go and visit them sometimes. Here, take this camera. Better off in your hands than sitting here collecting algae. Gosh, thanks! Let's keep going, Judy. Aye, aye, Captain. Follow me. We're looking for anything in particular here? Nah. Can't hurt to look around, though. Picking up very chill vibes. Feels like we're outside of time. Like, in a snow globe. After that, we can see what lies up ahead.
This isn't yours? Poor thing. Been here all alone for 20 years. So it is yours? No. It was Jenny Chapman's. You took her doll? As if. Hit it. It was a monster. You hit it? W why? Because I thought only losers played with dolls. What I really wanted was for her to notice me. Ah, the days when dolls were just kids' toys and nothing else. Imagine anything that could be more out of place in an underwater world. Hmm. Bottled water? <laughs> touché, Judy, touché. You gotta say, don't really get why they left their wheels behind when they had to evacuate. Hey, how old do you think I am? These hunks of metal have got half a century on them. When I was about yay high, they were already here. Better shape. Good cover for playing Max Tack and Psychos, though. Want to see what's further on? Come on, then. Want to show you something. Got no idea how weird it feels swimming through here. Where you used to run as a kid. Where daily life grinded along. Can imagine it a bit. Church hasn't aged at all. It always looked old and like it had landed here from outer space. Bells were cracked too. It gave off this eerie, atonal clang. Weird, I had no memory of that seconds ago. Now I can almost hear him. Don't know how it's possible, but I think I hear those bells too. Seriously? You can hear my memories? It must be a side effect. Ah, closed. Shame. Could look for another way inside. Be my guest. You like going to this church? Never actually went to church. Never even really paid attention to it. It was just there, you know? Once we knew Laguna Bend was to be flooded, people gathered here to plan a protest. Did it achieve anything? <sighs> Look around. Found an opening. Think we're safe to go through here. On my way. Passed out. How'd you manage to lift me out? Dunno, didn't think about it. Just did what I had to do. Hey, careful, easy now. <laughs> so, you're saying you saved my life. Thank you. Told you diving into this toxic waste was gonna end badly. But you just don't fucking listen. Toxic waste? Is that your construct? You heard him? Uh, 
Herd's overstating is just surfaced in my head. A thought that wasn't mine or completely yours. Please just ignore his babbling. It's a mm, complicated relationship. Why do I even bother? Doubt you should go back to the city just now. I'm pretty beat too. Last thing I want to do is drive. Let's stay the night. What do you think? Why the hell not? Whose cottage is that then? You said you knew the owner. One of our neighbors was hell bent on staying in Laguna Bend. Padges literally dragged him out of his house before the water came in. So he built himself another house as close as he possibly could, but then he got sick. Water was way more toxic back then. Must be chilled to the bone. I'll brew a pot. How do you take yours? Two sugars, please. Mm, tough on the outside, sweet on the inside. Ah, forgot to start the generator. I could turn it on. You're gonna take it easy. Promise to take it slow. Think you could have fine-tuned the emotive wave transmitters better back there. Got some serious surges from you a few times. Power's up. You go that way, so be careful. What was that? Couldn't hear you clearly. Something the matter? No, nothing. Don't bullshit me, Judy. We're still synced, remember? Clouds has gone to shit. Tiger Claw Nonex took revenge for Hiromi and the rest. There was a firefight. Tom's dead. Roxanne. Barely got out alive. House is closed until further notice. I'd rather not talk or think about it. I didn't want to tell you. Wanted this to be just our day. I, I want it. It is ours.
Will you sit with me a while? Here's your coffee. Morning, finally. So, yesterday. What was that exactly? Don't remember, or you want me to remind you? You know exactly what I'm trying to say. What did it mean, like, to you? I think it... I mean... I hope it was the beginning of something nice. Unless you see things differently. Ugh. It can be such a gonk sometimes. Ruined my plans, you know that? Was gonna leave Night City in the dust for good. Even started packing. But now, I think... I think I gotta stay. Ah, oh, well. Guess I'll have to make it up to you, won't I? Hmm. Yeah, that would be appropriate. Give me your hand, B. All set, congrats. Just gave you unlimited access to my pad. Whoa. Uh, asking me to move in? If it's what you want. Or just drop by when the urge grabs you. Don't know what to say. Nobody's ever done anything like this for me. Really shows trust. Wanna go there now? You can if you want. Gonna stick around for a bit before I head back. See ya, Judy.